Hi, so you have this related race problem uh, involving the ideal gas law, right? PV equals NRT. So we have a bunch of givens, right? We know that the pressure is increasing at a rate of 0 0.13 atmospherics per minute, right? So that's DP, DT is 0 0.13. We know that our volume is decreasing at a rate of 0.17 liters per minute, right? So I'm gonna put a negative sign here, right? So that's our DVDT. And we know that R is 0 0.0821. And way at the end of the question, they said um, to let the number of moles be 10, right? So our job is to find a rate of temperature increase with respect to time when the pressure is seven atmosphere and the volume is 13 liters. So first and foremost, let's look at it and make sure that all the units match, right? So we see atmosphere, atmosphere, minutes, minutes, moles, and this is essentially uh, dimensionless. So what's the thing with this problem is that there are two variables, right? So you have a P and a V, where normally you only see one. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna solve for P and V individually, right? So we know that P is NRT, over V. Likewise, we know that V, right, the variable size by P is NRT over our pressure P. Hmm, how can we make a DP, DT pop out? Well, we know that dp dt right is going to be according to the chain rule dp d capital t which is our temperature times right change of temperature over the change of time so time is going to be lowercase t okay so looking here dp dt right so n r v are constants t is the variable dp dt is going to be n r over v so this is equal to oh sorry about the first this this is n r over v times d t over d t now if i look here right we could say that d v d t is the, the change of value with respect to temperature. So capital T times DT, D capital T over DT, which is going to be right. Treat this as a variable and RP or constants. That's going to be N R over P times 
times dt dt. All right, capital T, temperature, and we have our lowercase t. So the, we need to solve for this, right? They want the rate of increase for the temperature. So if we look at this equation, if I divide both sides by nr over v, right, we get that dt. Again, that's temperature over dt. is equal to dp over dt. Divided by and R over V. And if we look here, right, DT over DT, lowercase t, is DV. Right, a change of value respect to time. Divided by NR over P. And I run out of space. So we have DT over DT, and we also have another DT over DT. So whenever you have this situation, you're just going to take the sum of these two. So I'm going to open a new window here. So if I were to add D, so what's our DP, DT? That was given as 0 0.13. So 0 0.13. All right, divided by... N, that's 10. R is uh, 0 This thing divided by, make this larger to not confuse you, 13, right? The value was 13 liters. So this plus dv dt, that's negative 0.17. So plus or minus, so I'm going to subtract it, essentially. All right, and it's still 10. i make that a little more. Point zero zero eight two one over seven calculator work this comes out to be zero point six zero nine zero So your answer was pretty close. I don't know, maybe it was either a calculated error or a mathematical mistake. But this is the answer to four decimal places.
Hope the soaps.